Friendly greetings, this is Torley, just a very quick and fun guide to sounding like a robot with built-in Ableton Live stuff. So the vocoder here is what we'll use. We have an audio and a MIDI track, both are blank. Now I'm gonna go ahead and click and drag this right on. And then here we have, you can feel free to copy my settings. Some of these other presets will work okay too. I customized this for my beloved purposes. Now let's go to the MIDI track and let's drag. So I have, this one's also a built-in sound, this lead or lead, like I like to say, fifths, click and drag that on. It's quite harmonically rich. You can hear it when I play. And by itself, it sounds quite robot-like. It's a good choice, very techno-y. So back here in audio, now we can go ahead, make sure your carrier is external, make sure that audio from, change that to, the same name, so right here it's lead, fifths, right? And that will work because now you notice when I'm playing, okay, not a robot voice yet, but the green little thing is all that. Okay, good. So now what we need to do is we can disable the singular output of this, which means this track by itself isn't going to make a sound, but it's still gonna be routed through the vocoder, okay? So let's just disable that there. And I'm just gonna hold, I just hold control right here and then I am going to press the record thing here and my voice is going to be a robot, you'll see. Because then that means I can select both to record in, I can play into there and at the same time it'll be auditioning my voice right through here. Witness. Hello, I am a robot. And it, there we go, I can have my voice back just to <laughs> bring myself of oh, that control. I'm just gonna go through a bunch more like this and tweak some of the controls so you can hear what sorts of effects it might have. I encourage you to, to play around. I have the widest, the most bandwidth here. Oh, it's 40, as you can see, because it tends to be more intelligible. Otherwise, you can get really, really like a <laughs> very, very primitive, a four bit robot or something like that. More robot voices. your command. So lots of fun, as you can see in here. Just really, really, really groovy. Oh, oh, one thing I forgot to do was I didn't mess around with individual settings for you. I should I should do that so you can hear the what tweaking parameters we'll have. Okay, back to the robot voices. <laughs> You'll 
have fun with this. Go ahead, Ableton Live just makes it so easy. I remember the old days, it used to be so tough with the hardware setup and all the wiring, but now in a few minutes, as you can see, you can make your own robot sounds. 